Hey everybody, Brian from Tato Gear here. What we're going to look at today is the Element Titanium Wood Stove. We're going to take an in-depth look at it, uh, how it works, uh, the different options of it, uh, a little bit about the construction. Uh, so, hope you enjoy. So, the Element Titanium is 4.8, 5 ounces. Uh, it weighs uh, 141 grams. It folds flat, as you can see here. This is the one that's taken apart. It's really thin. Fold flat design. It's hinged. So it's less pieces to lose. It is an odd shape uh, just because of the conical shape that the stove takes when it's uh, put together. So it does fold up a little odd, but it doesn't take up that much room in your pack. Uh, like I say, it's really thin, it's really light, and it's really durable. So let's look at a couple of the features. You have these rails. Uh, this will help you accommodate smaller pots. Um, a lot of people like to use uh, honey kegs. Uh, this will let you put those on there or the foster pot. Uh, but you don't have to use them. If, if your pot will sit directly on it, great. Uh, it is pinned. It has a single pin which allows it to come apart and then you have a bottom grate. Now all this will fold up nice and small together and fit right in your pack. And to assemble it, the easiest way I've found is to hold it flat in your hand. Take and put your grate in, fold it, fold it, and fold it up. Pull your pin, and then slide it right back in. Easy as that. Now, this thing also features a side door and it does a couple things it allows better airflow and it allows you to feed larger longer sticks of wood to get a more consistent burn <clears throat> that keeps you from having to take wood and constantly be feeding it through the front port as you're trying to cook. Uh, with this side door, as it burns down a little, just keep sliding it in. Uh, it works great. Now, another unique feature of the Element that no other stove, wood stove on the market has the ability to do is create fire rings. You can take two element stoves put them in unison or three or four stoves it doesn't matter. Put them in unison hook them together My hands weren't so fiddly this morning. And there you have an element fire ring. Now you can go as big as you want. If you have three, four guys on your trip who's all carrying stoves, you can have a pretty nice fire ring here. Uh, and not only is it just a fire ring, but if uh, you have or four guys you may all want to cook together and use a, a little larger pot or you may want to lay a grate across it you can lay a grate across this have a larger fire and set multiple cook pots on it at one time instead of having to 
boil your water for this meal and then boil your water for your coffee. You can do multiple things at one time. So, another good thing about the Element is its ability to become a windscreen. I always carry an alcohol stove because you just don't know when it's going to rain, if you can find dry wood. You can use this as a windscreen like this. You can also put it together. Set your stove directly in the bottom and set your pot on top and cook that way. Now, if you've got a pretty short stove, you may need to set something in there to get that stove up to height. So that's the features of the wood stove, the Element wood stove. Um, so let's uh, let's look at lighting one up and. Uh, watch it burn so to load this just take your twigs and what I'm going to use to light mine today there are several ways you can light this you can take the cotton ball with Vaseline put right in the bottom um, you can take a little cap full of alcohol sit right there light it sit your stove on top of it what I'm going to do today is I'm going to use a little piece of this fat wood and you can get this right on our website uh, we do offer this and I'm going to use a piece of fat wood to start the stove so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to lay that in I'll sort of break it a little bit so it stands up somewhat I'm going to lay that in so it's easy to get to and then I'm going to start loading the wood and I usually just throw it in I, I don't have no rhyme or reason how I do this uh, and yeah, we're just going to put it in like that. And we're going to take the lighter and we're going to light that little piece of fat wood in here. You can see, uh, you're starting to get a flame out of the top. Um, it doesn't take but just a few minutes. As you can see, it's coming up to temperature. It's still got a little bit of smoke. As this thing gets hotter, you're going to see a lot less smoke. It's not a true gasifier, as it doesn't have the, the double wall and, and recirculates air, but it does gasify. It gets hot enough that it burns that smoke as it comes right out of the top. It'll start burning that smoke as it gets hotter. You can cook on it, have campfires. It's just a great little stove. So as this thing burns, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and add a larger stick to it to get it going. Just slide it right in on in the mix. 